Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Myself Malkai Santosh. Hope all are doing fine. Today I came up with one more Java program which was frequently asked in automation testing interviews. Before going to that, uh, if you have gone to my channel, I have made Java program videos for the interview preparation. So hope you have gone through it. If anyone uh, didn't go, kindly go through this, it will be very useful to you. And also I have done one more uh, tech technical challenge video how to transform database data to Pojo object so kindly go to this video as well to get more knowledge on how the technical challenges have been uh, done in the project level so let's start our today's video in today's video we are converting array list to hash map array list and hash maps comes under collections framework so array list is implementing list interface and hash map is implementing map interface. I have created a list and I have inserted few string variables which are Santosh, Prom, Harry and Santosh again. So as we can insert duplicate elements in the list, I have placed a duplicate element as well. So if once I have run this program, the list will get printed. Let me print the program. So you can see we got the list of names. So as list is allowing duplicate elements, uh, we are going to enter any uh, number of duplicates here. Coming to hash map, hash map should be in key value pair. So it should be in key value pair. Hash map should be value pair and key should be unique there should not be any duplicate values and value can be okay. so before converting we need to consider these factors here whenever someone asks to convert an array list so you need to think of why they are asking to do that okay so if you are considering these values as key so how can a duplicate value can be a key because they want these four elements to be inserted into map so you need to think uh, a different way a different approach how to insert these four values into the map so you can choose value as your variables which are in list and key you should think it as a unique value so what are the unique values we can consider in list okay you can you also know right so list have indexes okay list have indexes so each index is having one variable string name okay let's say list dot so names dot get of index so let's say if i call zero so it will pin the first index value okay let me print that so let me print this value let me run the program let's see we are getting the first index value okay so we got the first index value here is santosh and so here the indexing is unique all the time so we have four indexes 0 1 2 3 so these indexes we can use it as key and we can store the values in the key okay so that uh, we can achieve a key value pair and we can create a key as unique and value as duplicates as well okay let's do it so let me create a hash map first hash map, so hash map is expecting a key value pair key should be an integer as we are inserting the index and the value should be string okay i am naming it as map hash map to hash map okay so once you have created a map object here now you need to insert the key value pair to insert it we have put method okay so before that let me start the indexing by creating a value here like index equal to zero okay 
before inserting let's try to take a for loop so we can iterate each and every item so for each name in list which is names okay we need to iterate and we need to put the values in the map let me keep that okay the value should be index okay comma name and then i will increment my index for the further values to be inserted okay now if i so now we need to print the will print the map let's try to run the program we achieved it so we got zero santosh one wrong two hurry and three santosh on top of that we will try to iterate map as well so to iterate map we have many types so let me take one of the thing from iterating so i will use uh, map dot entry to use the entry set object every time okay let me create a map dot key value pair which is integer comma string as entry here okay now i will take the map dot So it is taking uh, it should be map dot entry we are asking to take it as a set okay let's take it as a set as we are including unique values now import the set here now the error got now let me iterate it let me take the advanced for each loop okay now for every entry so for every map dot entry we will take the now let us print the key value pairs so let me print the key here key is so our key is entry entry dot get key and the value is key dot get value okay let me run this program and see whether the iteration is happening correct so yeah let me give some gap here after the is so that it will print in correct format we run this program again okay awesome so you can see uh, we have created a list of names so we got the list of names here later we have converted the list of names into hash map by taking each index value as in a uh, unique key and the name as the value okay so now we have inserted all these values in the map and we have printed the map here so we got the map of list names which is 0 santosh 1 rom 2 hari and 3 santosh later we have iterated the hash map by using the entry set okay so we have a entry set method here for that we need to use the map dot entry so after we are iterating the map dot entry each entry we are taking as a key value pair so key dot entry dot get key and entry dot get value so we are entering iterating each key and value so this is how we will convert the array list to hash map okay 
so just think before whenever someone asks questions like convert hash map to uh, array list or array list to hash map let's think why they are asking for it because uh, array list is uh, we can insert multiple duplicate values but in map in key we can't insert the duplicate values so you need to mold according to the concept okay so this is how we achieve the array list to hash map conversion hope you have liked this video and subscribe to my channel for further videos if you have subscribed uh, that will give me more energy to do more videos okay, and also like and share my videos uh, to your friends to your colleagues okay uh, let them share the knowledge and thank you everyone have a great day bye